Hey XM's users, the default operation mode for the included ASUS in your link system is wireless router. This default mode is great if you are interested in a standalone setup with just your PC and the link suit. However, if you're working from home and you need your XM's workstation to have an internet connection and a connection to a VPN, then I recommend changing the ASUS operation mode from a wireless router to an access point or AP mode. As an access point, your home router or the router in your office will provide an automatic IP address to the ASUS and the Link body pack. In this tutorial, I'd like to explain how to set up the ASUS as an access point and share with you some network troubleshooting techniques. Let's get started. Take the ASUS out of its case, power it on and wait for it to fully boot up. Connect an Ethernet cable from a yellow LAN port on the back of the ASUS to your PC. Confirm that your PC isn't connected to any other networks. Hold the reset button down until you see the blue light above the power logo start to flash. Remove your finger and let the ASUS reset fully. After two to three minutes, the web interface for the ASUS will pop up automatically. If not, then type the IP address 192.168.0.1 into your search browser. For access point, click on advanced settings, select choose operation mode, select access point AP mode, select automatic IP, set a name and password for the 2.4 and 5 gigahertz SSIDs, and finally set a router login name and password. Once you reach the page that says Summary, it's then safe to connect your home router to the ACES access point. Make sure the Ethernet cable is plugged into a LAN port, both on the side of your home router and the ACES. The next step is downloading the Discovery tool to ultimately identify the IP address assigned to it. The easiest way to do this is to go to the XN's knowledge base and search the article called the XSENS ASUS as a wireless access point. Scroll down to the ASUS device discovery tool link and wait for it to complete downloading. Then extract the zip file, install the tool and run it. When the application is open, it'll look like this. Click the search button to identify the IP address of the ASUS access point. Then click configure to log into the ASUS web portal. Once you are in the portal, turn off the 2.4 GHz band and do a WPS scan in the 5 GHz band. Go to Wireless and click on the Professional tab. Check that the band is set to 2.4 and select No in the field that says Enable Radio. Go to the bottom of the screen and press Apply. Next, go to the WPS tab. Switch the frequency to 5 GHz and enable it. Once enabled, scroll to the bottom of the page and toggle on the push button bubble. Do not press start. Grab your link body pack and turn it on. Wait for the solid light. Hold the solid light down until you hear a double beep. This puts the body pack in WPS scan mode. Now, press the start button in the ACES portal and wait for the connection to be successful. To confirm that a hardware connection has been made between the Link Body Pack and ASUS Access Point, open MVN and start a motion capture session. Do the green spheres appear? If they do, you can begin your motion capture shoot. If not, then I recommend doing this troubleshooting technique. Check the IP address of the Link Body Pack by connecting it to your PC via a micro USB cable. In a search engine, type 172.16.0.1. This will load the web interface for the body pack. Check the body pack's IP address. Does the address reflect the correct network? If not, a simple way to fix this is to disconnect and reconnect. You may have to do this several times before you get the desired IP address. Once the body pack becomes a proper host of your local area network, then disconnect the micro USB cable from the body pack and reopen MVN. You should now see the green spheres in the motion capture configuration window.